Alright, so this is going to be a video about Windows 10, and I've talked about Windows 10 in the past many times, and I've talked about the bugs within Windows 10, and many of the bugs I've noticed have been pretty bad. They've required restarts of the entire operating system, and it's bothered me a lot. And basically, after installing the November update, which the November update was supposed to stop many of the bugs and fix them, but at, right after installing it, I had noticed one, which I'll show you in a video. It was recorded with my phone, because I can never get a screen recorder to work on this computer. I can get them perfectly to work on my phone, but never on this computer. And, first of all, before getting the November update, I it would not install. It would just kept, I would just keep getting errors, and... I searched online and supposedly if you have an SD card inside your computer, taking it out and restarting it and then trying it again would fix it. And that did, but once I got the update installed, I noticed another bug which was pretty bad and I was just trying to move around some icons in my start menu and I found this. And good, thankfully a restart um, fixed it and I didn't lose any of the spot, any of the positions of my icons, but it's still pretty annoying how this is happening considering how Windows 10 this update was supposed to fix many of the bugs if Microsoft can make the Xbox One's operating system much faster and they made and they've made improvements to many products before I bet they can do it to Windows 10 and if Google can make Android from the 2.2 versions being a very slow operating system very crappy to being something within 4.0 to 5.0 and even now in 6.0, something that's very fast, I bet Microsoft can do the same. I'm pretty disappointed with this, and, well, I'm going to have to keep dealing with it, because it's the only computer I can use to edit these videos with, but I'm going to show you this right now on the recording I just made. So as you just saw that, I don't really know what was happening. Thankfully restarting the computer helped, but I, I'm, I'm really getting annoyed by this. It's still better than on Windows 10 when none of the store apps would open or the start menu or Cortana would not open, but it's still better than that bug, which I haven't had yet happen yet, which I really hope that one was fixed because that one was very annoying. And the Windows 10 bugs I've had are not like simple things like an animation or something not working but these are things that require restarts which if I'm working on a video or something and um, the start menu won't open let's say I wanna look for a picture and I can't access the start menu that's really a problem to me and having to save it and export it and then restart my computer again just really bothers me and Hopefully by the end of next year, yes, I was hoping by this November update it would have been all fixed, but hopefully by then we'll get a smooth operating system and it's maybe even as smooth as Windows 7. I've never had problems like this on 8 or 7. As much as people disliked 8, 8 hasn't had as many bugs as Windows 10. And I do like Windows 10. When it works, I like it. That's all I really had to say about this and... Post a comment below, how has your Windows 10 experience been with the November update? Has it been buggy or has it worked perfectly? That's all I really have to say. Hope you enjoyed this video and bye.